Bwana Sfiwe. Today is a very short time for Brigade because it's not our week, but uh, through the compassion and support of our minister, we have a brief time to have our children, 68 of them, uh, commissioned and given uh, a reward through the subject that you are going to see because in the last quarter they have qualified not only through physical activities but they have also been trained and uh, examined this uh, last week by our officers here. Only one appeal I would like to make and we are going to officers you can be coming forward. We are not having um, men officers. A couple of years we used to say we don't have children, um, boys, but now we have, so we are almost balanced. But uh, we are lacking models, particularly from uh, the men. And therefore we are appealing. Uh, shortly we'll be sending a letter to the district and the different groups so that you can bring any son, any daughter that can come. And as parents, if you have a son at home, and if you have a daughter, the young one, talk to them and they can join us. The qualification is not the uniform, as some have whispered, that they cannot come because of the uniform or the training. The qualification is the willingness to serve a child. The way you serve this child at home is the way we would like you to come and serve that child here. So now, officers, please come forward. And as I do that, I would like to introduce our guest today, Madam Kendi. Uh, please come forward and introduce the national trainers and other officers that are coming to help us with the occasion. Thank you very much. So officers, please come. Today, I'm not going to introduce all of you, but you'll be upstarting by now. What's happening? Yeah, you should be upstarting. So these are the, the train, this, these are the, the team that has, uh, has actually trained your children and they are very committed. They are not as many against the number of children that uh, you have brought because the number is very large. I can see fun on there, Unione after this. <laughs> you don't have uniform and like wanna. Yeah, I can see you have stood up, but come, come down, Mesa Mewa, because we are in the church, but come and see us after this. So, officers, you can be coming forward so that we do these activities, but let me invite uh, Madam Kendi to speak on behalf of the national trainers. Thank you. Praise God, Church. Uh, my name is Kendi Dafina, and more to that, uh, I am born again. I come from PCA, Zimmerman, Girls Brigade Company, Zimmerman Parish. Uh, Nairobi, uh, Nairobi North Presbytery, Nairobi Region, and I belong to the Girls' Brigade Kenya. Uh, now that officers are standing, I wish to take a very short time to introduce uh, my colleagues. Uh, welcome, uh, Trina Washieni. Uh, is Trina Washieni, I am going to give him a chance later. Is Trina Washieni from PCA Bahati, Nairobi Central uh, Presbytery. And uh, right now, he is in charge of Milimani North Presbytery for the brigade training purposes. Uh, we also have Sir Francis Mbari, who is a student trainer. He comes from uh, PCA Kahawa West uh, Boys Brigade Company in Nairobi North Presbytery. Uh, uh, we want to start our service, and as we continue awarding the uh, boys and girls with the sashes, we are going uh, to elaborate what it all entails. So uh, I am going to request all boys and girls to be upstanding together with the officers. Don't know whether I can get another mic. All officers, all officers, to the front, we march.
Chaplain, sir, we request that you may turn this service from a normal worship service to an enrollment and badge award service, sir. Aye. Motion granted. Thank you, sir. All men and boys, you may now put on your head caps. Boys and girls and officers, stand at ease. Chaplain, sir, you may now preside over the service. Thank you. It's a great joy to see our uh, officers and our children and we want to now go through the commissioning service. We'll start with our officers here. Another uh, song up and he, Mahali Kuna, Maria could kneel down. Can push a bit. Unambianga, you left turn. Come on. Okay. Sa, sa. Little cover up. Thank you. Brothers and sisters, these people who are standing here in front of us have been chosen uh, by you, the officers, and the Boys and Girls Brigade according to the grace which uh, he has given to all men and women according to this particular call for Boys and Girls Brigade and the advancement of the kingdom of God among boys and the promotion of habits of obedience and reference, discipline, self-respect, and all that tends towards true Christian manliness and for girls, to help girls become followers of our Lord Jesus Christ uh, through self-control, reverence, and a sense of responsibility to find true enrichment in life. You are now required before God and before this congregation to answer the questions that I will ask you in accordance with the practice of this church. Question one, do you believe in one God, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, and do you confess that Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior? Thank you. Do you renew your undertaking to serve God in furthering the objectives of Boys Brigade and the principles of Girls Brigade? Yes, I do. Question three. Do you promise to leave us a good Christian to seek God's power to help you grow spiritually as you spread the goals through principles of Boys and Girls Brigade? Will you be devoted as members of Boys and Girls Brigade to live in fellowship with one another? Yes, I do. All right. Finally, do you acknowledge the form of government of this church and its discipline, remembering at all times that Jesus Christ is the head of this church? Yes, I do. Wonderful. So, i my coffee. We want now to commission the, uh, the captains first, then later the lieutenant and the warrant officers. So I now commission you, I want you, to, uh, Sir Gesheru Akujembele, the two. The two. Uh, yes, sir. All right. And Catherine Mwaura. Yes, sir. All right. I now commission you as captains of PCA Sukari Boys and Girls Brigade companies, respectively, on behalf of this church. And I promise to support you through prayers and cooperation so that the ideals of Boys and Girls Brigade may be achieved. And I do this in the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. We want to dedicate these uh, so that our, our, our captains may change. We dedicate these uh, cards, these reindeers and sashes for the sake of this uniform ministry in our church. That as your servants wear them, Lord, they will be good soldiers of you in service of you wherever they go. We dedicate them right now. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Amen. God, do you want to change? Ah, yeah. I will request uh, Trainer Washeni. Uh, we are going to change the boys' captain. And uh, being a captain, we are going to call Sir Patrick to the front. He has been acting as the captain, and he has served for three years. And uh, it is a policy that once you serve, 
for three years, you are supposed to get another captain. So Trinagishero, today we is a lieutenant. We are promoting him to be a captain for the boys' company. And uh, here in Sukari, we have two companies. We have the boys' company that comprises of all the boys and their men officers. And then also we have the girls' company. That is all the girls and the lady officers. So from today onwards, you are going to hand over that to the chaplain so that you press remove both. Then they will be prayed for by the chaplain. Then you are going to receive them back so that we change them. So every time uh, we are conducting our trainings, the captains, the two captains are in charge of all brigade programs. That is uh, the camps uh, when uh, we are doing the badge work, when we have the weekly meetings. The captains are supposed to conduct meetings together with all the rest of the officers. And they are supposed to come up with a program or now to train them. So we request the chaplain ah, yeah. to pray for the Rainiers and then we give them back accordingly. These two Rainiers are dedicated in the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Ah, yeah. I request a student trainer and trainer Washeni. Trainer Washeni, you hand that to the captain, the incoming captain, Sagishero. And uh, we want to encourage the rest of us to continue working hard because we have Sagishero who is I think uh, we've allowed him to serve for one year because according to the policy, you are not supposed to, ha to hold any elective post after the age of 65 years. So he is going to serve. But next time we are having such a service, we are going to have another captain. But he will stay there. He will continue being a brigade officer. But that time he will be a mentor to the young men officers. So, thank you so very much. We've done that. Now we go to the other part. Santi. All right. Sir Peter Mbae, you say? Here, sir. Here, sir. Good. Captain Mohende. Uh, Captain, uh, Stephen Mohende. Yes, sir. Sir Patrick and Juguna. Yes, sir. Sir John Dongo. Yes, sir. Sir Fanom Irino. Yes, sir. Madam Gladys Moth. Mutahi, uh, Madam Anne Kehio, yes, sir. Madam Esther Moreu, yes, sir. Madam Caroline Kenywa, yes, sir. Madam Margaret Mobashia, yes, sir. Uh, my, uh, Elder Harriet Mai. Yes, Those are the lieutenants, and then we want to go now to the warrant officers. Then we hear back. Hey, hey. Sir Eric Ochieng. Yes, <laughs> Your name is not in the book of life. <laughs> Did you say yes, sir? <laughs> sawa, sawa. Then we go to the warrant officers. Oh, Tabitha Kebara. Madam Tabitha Kebara. And then finally, Dr. Masharia. Sawa, sawa. Umesema, sir? Then we have the warrant officers. The first one is Madam Sophie Mokua. Absent. Sir Ibrahim Macharia. All right. Niyohule. Ah, yeah. Being officers of PCS Ukari Parish Boys and Girls Brigade companies, I now commission you in your respective offices as lieutenants and warrant officers. May God grant you grace to be faithful and may he crown your work with success. And I do this in the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. You all say, please, be, uh, take, take, uh, please kneel as the other members of the church stand. So that we pray for the captains, the two captains, the warrant officers, and the lieutenant. Let us pray. Almighty God, our, our Heavenly Father, our helper, for without you we labor in vain, and without your grace all wisdom is folly. We ask that, Lord, you may grant these your servants the will to undertake their new roles. Guide them, O Lord by giving them the strength to perform their new duties, and that you bestow on them your grace as they do it. Teach them, O Lord, to serve you, even as they serve the children as you deserve from heaven. Give them, O Lord, grace to do that which you have called them to do, to give and not to take, to labor as they shall be rewarded, 
with the blessing of your son Jesus Christ. So we declare that Lord God Almighty Jesus, your servants are commissioned for this new year. This is our prayer of faith in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Please stand as the members of the congregation uh, sit. And now, may the blessing of God, the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit be upon you, captains, be upon you, lieutenants, be upon you, uh, uh, warrant officers. May the Lord guide you as you serve our children, both now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. The children now, I'm sure you will push back, so that you help me do the work. Captains, we are not, we are skipping some of the procedures because of time, so you... He invite all the, you call all the girls, then he calls all the boys, then one of you presents them to the chaplain. Twins and boys. Oh, oh by boys, captain, attention. By the front, quick march. Come forward. Girls company, attention to the front quick match. Go marching in. Oh, and the saints go marching in. Hallelujah. Oh, Lord, I want to be among the number. Oh, and the saints go marching. All right. I think we are happy that our girls and boys are here. We can ask the guardians to stand and the parents, whatever they are. Let us stand up wherever we are. We may not fit in here. I'm sure you are always uh, ready to buy the uniform to raise our children to come to church. So kindly stand as a way as they take their vows this morning. Boys and girls desiring to be enrolled as members of Boys and Girls Brigade, do you promise to obey the rules and the regulations of the company and set an example of good conduct for other, to other boys and girls? Right. May God give you strength to be faithful to his work, royal to your friends, and strong in times of temptations that you will always be his faithful servants. Yes. All right. Boys and girls motto? Boys first. All right. Girls? All right. Then the boys now can say their uh, objective. Start with boys. All right, may the girls now say their mission and aim. You can hear the difference, members of this congregation, between boys and girls. <laughs> it's because we have no many men in this team. So can we ask men to join us? Amen? So we have no energy. Because ladies are more. So we want to encourage uh, that we have men in this, in this church to join us in this ministry. I now commission you as members of Boys and Girls Brigade. And I do so in the name of God, the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. We all say... Amen and amen. I'll ask you now to kneel so that we can pray. Kama kuna koshon nisawa, kama hakuna, nini askari. It's part of the sacrifices that you do for the sake of the kingdom. Let now all of us stand. Thank you, parents, for standing with your children. All right, let us pray. Almighty and everlasting God, hear our prayers today as we pray for these children. Let your mighty hand be upon them, Lord, we pray. Let your Holy Spirit be ever with them and lead them in the knowledge and obedience of your word that they may serve you in their lives 
And we pray this through Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. And even, Lord, pray that you give them strength to serve, even follow you. For this is our prayer of faith in Jesus' name. Amen. amen and amen. I want us now to stand. The rest of us can sit as our teachers do the other work. Uh, thank you so much. We request you, Chaplain, you give us five minutes. We'll Aye. be done. Five minutes. May now take, Starting take a seat. now. Yes. All <laughs> officers, men officers, we are going to award this. Yeah, remove your sweaters very fast. If you have a sweater, remove it very fast. Then uh, we have men officers collecting the sachets and the linians for the boys, and then the ladies collecting uh, for the girls. We do it very fast. We have five minutes. And uh, as we do that, I want to welcome Trina Washiani to explain to us what is going on. Welcome, sir. Praise the Lord, church. If you are seeing me, do like this. If you can see me, if you can see me. Thank you. Isoni Salamu. Those are my greetings. As we have been told by Madam Candy, we work with her in this presbytery. But we thank God because you are training a student trainer. You will be together with her. And please, children, children, don't make noise. You are in the altar. So you need to observe discipline. Are we together? Yes. So that is the exercise that is going on. First of all, it's good to know what is brigade. Brigade is a Christian uniform organization which is international and interdenominational for both boys and girls. Why is it international and interdenomination? Brigade was started in 1883 in Scotland by a novice called Sir William Alexander Smith. So Brigade was found at Scotland and he was a church school teacher. He saw it better to come up with this organization. So that's why Brigade is international, both the boys and girls. Also, it's interdenominational because we have other churches with the Brigade. That is Anglican, Church, Methodist, SSNS, Independent Church, and then Presbyterian Church of East Africa. Number two, he came up with the two pillars. This church have got pillars. Na kama hii kanisa hii na pillars, I mama. The two pillars of the brigade is religion and discipline. Because it is within the church. That's why brigade is a Christian uniformed organization. It's founded within the church. And the Sir William Alexander Smith came up with a with the cerebus connected with the two pillars. And the cerebus is four square program whereby we cover spiritual, we cover education, we cover social, and we cover physical. We want the children to grow the way Jesus Christ grew in stature and in wisdom and in favor with God and man. That's why they are being put in the searches. The yellow is for boys and the red is for girls. That cerebus is called Bajwak Scheme. Bajwak Scheme. And Bajwak Scheme has got 27 subjects. 27 subjects. The first one is Christian Education, Stage 1. If you can see the children when they come home, or when they are here, the first one is the yellow badge with the Bible. The second one is green with the Bible, the uh, stage two. Then stage three is maroon in color. Then we have first aid. We have HIV and AIDS. We have food and nutrition. We have drills that comes with the parade. 
Also, we have agriculture. So that is the syllabus. So what we are doing, we are want these children to have lifestyles that even if he completes the school or the degree, he can be able to go to make agriculture. He can be able to be in first aid organization. All that kind of subject we teach these children. So if you have a, a boy or a girl, he or she is not in brigade. He is welcome. She is welcome. We have officers here. We are able to train them the lifestyle and they will be able to live a good life. At this time, this generation want to raise uh, men and women and girls and boys who fear the Lord. We will not be able to involve this, themselves with LBQ and other things so that they will be able to have great men and women in the kingdom of God and people to continue serving in this church. But you guys, we need to invest more with this team. Amen. We want them, the buildings that you are making there, you can make very big buildings and we will be able to continue, to continue when you are not there. So you have a very good team and our Sukari or Sukari Parish, you are in the right direction. So God bless you. That is, if you want to know more, to come to the brigade as an officer is from 19 years to 99. Active from 19 to 65. So God bless you. I know you have learned something. So everybody here, none are above 99. So you can visit brigade anytime when they are meeting and give them a word, not a must you become an officer. So God bless you as we continue supporting this team. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, a national trainer. Once you are uh, dressed, face the congregation, it will want to smart. About turn. Good. All right. Can you see how smart they are? Congregation, let us clap for these children. They are very, very well dressed. We'll give you a chance later. The parents will pick a picture pal Angel because of time. And now because they are all done, you can now face faster. Turn about. Turn about. Turn. All right. And now, my dearly beloved, I commit you to the hand of God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. May the Lord bless you so much as you serve him. May you become great soldiers of him as uniformed boys and girls. And I speak the blessing of God, the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, and it will be upon you both now and forevermore. Amen. We all say, Amen. 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 All right. Uh, thank you for this exercise. Najua kuna wengine wamepatiwa mshipisi yao, sindiyo? Because the number of badges shows zile mitiani umefanya. Immediately, I have instructed the captains, immediately after this service, make sure that you get your right. Sash, is that okay? So usibandirisha ne kwa kanisa. Tutabandirisha badai. Thank you so much. Thank you, Chaplain, sir, for presiding over this service. We now request you to revert the service to a normal worship service, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, all boys and men officers, remove your address. Put them where they are supposed to be. Uh, Brigade, we are going to present our song when we will be taking the offerings. Kaimri. Oh, it's right now. Oh, okay, okay. So, thank you, Kanisa Mbarikiwe Sana, Santi. Don't go away. Just come here for the song. We are, we are doing offerings now.